Jimmy Williams' mother in May 1966, Lincoln's call felt as distant as the Vietnamese jungle that took her son's life. With racial tensions high, Williams' hometown in rural Alabama claimed that there was no room in the local cemetery and instead offered him a pauper's grave elsewhere. His exasperated mother said, My son died fighting on the front for all of us. He didn't die a segregated death, and he'll not be buried in a segregated cemetery. In the midst of national news coverage of the controversy, the Williams family found justice and peace in the nearest national cemetery, Andersonville. A. Jimmy Williams was buried at Andersonville National Cemetery in Georgia by the site of the notorious Confederate prison ground at Andersonville. A century ago, 12,000 northern prisoners died here from disease, starvation, and wounds. Those dead were the first interred at this cemetery. It is an irony of history that the Confederate death ground is the final resting place for the Negro soldier from Alabama, killed in Vietnam, but for whom there was no room in the hometown burial ground. Hey. Oh.